Hello everyone. In this video, we will cover how to upload assignments that were graded offline as feedback files. First of all, this is a sample assignment. We need to go and get our submissions. To do that, all we need to do is use this drop down box here and just download all submissions. So you can save it anywhere you like. I'm just going to use my downloads folder. So the submissions have been downloaded as a zip file here, which I am going to just extract right now. So once extracted, you'll get a folder for each student and in each of the folders is the student's submission file. So let's get to marking. Okay, so on the left here, are the folders containing all of the submission files on the right here are the assignments that have been marked and all I need to do is replace each of the files in each of the folders for instance for this first student here let's get rid of the original submission and let's copy and paste the marked assignment into the folder like so so let's do this for every student Okay, so now I have copy and pasted all of the marked assignments into each folder appropriately. So what I need to do now is get rid of this old zip folder, just delete it, and zip this folder. Okay, and there it is, there's my new zip folder. And now I'm ready to upload my marked assignments. To do that, all we need to do is go back to the view submissions page. And in this drop-down box, choose Upload Multiple Feedback Files in a Zip. So once we choose that, we can upload our file. My file is this one right here. So I just click and drag it into the box. Wait for it to load. And now I can import feedback files. So now you can actually check that you have put the right file in the right folder. So I'm happy with this. Let's click on confirm. So it says that there have been 16 feedback files added. So let's just continue. And if you scroll to the right here, you'll see these are the files submitted by the students. And at the end here, under feedback files, these are the files that have been marked that I just uploaded. So that is how you upload assignments that have been marked online to eLearn and eLearn takes care of it so that you don't have to upload them one by one to each student. Thank you.